Another economic closure is hitting moviegoers. The Arclight theaters, including the iconic Pacific Cinerama Dome in Hollywood, will close for good. Now, that landmark and five other Southern California locations that closed more than a year ago will not reopen. That's right. KKL 9's Jeff Nguyen spoke to some moviegoers dealing with an end to an era. Tonight, Maggie Muir and Drew Sykes drove from their home in Burbank to pay tribute to the Arclight Theater in Hollywood. We have a lot of good memories here. Um, and, you know, it's hopefully kind of the end of this pandemic, and we were sad to see it go. The couple wanted to be here after the chain's parent company announced after shutting our doors more than a year ago, today we must share the difficult and sad news that Pacific will not be reopening its Arclight Cinemas and Pacific Theaters locations. That includes the iconic Pacific Cinerama Dome. It's, its landmark is so unique and the you know the gigantic screen is like the epitome of seeing a movie on a big screen the dome has screened movies like star wars the last jedi its director tweeted sending love to every usher manager and projectionist who rocked that blue shirt and made it such a special place yeah, i'm a first grade teacher so we did like a 2 a.m star wars movie oh yeah and then got coffee and i went and taught the next day the dome was prominently featured in Quentin Tarantino's Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, but it also provided space for independent films. She was doing it to make me feel better. I've had a movie actually screen at Arclight before, and I was just really bummed out. The theaters had been boarded up since last summer's demonstrations. The parent company, which had reportedly been negotiating its unpaid lease, has not ruled out selling the chain. In Hollywood, Jeff Nguyen, KCAL 9 News.